So these two young ladies here are probably our last, but I'm sure this is going to be probably one of the most in, uh, interesting interviews uh, of today. Uh, guys, you know we're here uh, for uh, the Meet the Professionals Day at OR, and uh, uh, Tawana Smith-Harris and Saran Creighton, attorneys. Oh boy, this is great. But, okay, let me ask you guys this question, because you know this is for the youth. Uh, do you consider, I know this is kind of an offshoot question, do you consider what you do a sustainable business? Would it, would, is, is being an attorney a sustainable? I would, well, hi, I'm Tawana. Yes. Um, and I would say that yes, it is a sustainable business. Um, unfortunately, uh, because there are so many individuals who end up on the wrong side of the law, and we're public defenders, um, and people commit crimes every day, that's just a society that we live in, that gives us a sustainable business. I mean, business is not slow at all. Wow. Um, the area of law that we practice currently is the civil division. Uh, we represent parents who've had their children taken away by DCFS. Mm -hmm. um, there are usually abuse and neglect allegations and we represent the parents to try to get their children back. Um, we also have a criminal division as well. Mm -hmm. um, and so with that being said, as I stated before, um, unfortunately people do abuse children. So it is a sustainable business that way. Mm -hmm. And unfortunately people do commit crimes. It is so, sustainable. Um, with that being the case, we don't have a shortage of business. It is a, a, a very lucrative thing also if you should want to go into private practice um, and not become a public defender because we offer our services. We're, we're considered to be free attorneys, so to speak. Plus, pe plus people that look like us, the more we're in this, the more we can help, uh, we can assist Absolutely. our folks. People so that that's us. sustainable. That's Absolutely. really sustainable. Uh, Saran, yes. attorney Creighton, that's what I, I'm sorry. Yes, but yeah, go ahead. But okay, but what are you guys are going to tell the young, the young ladies and the young men here at OR? Because uh, I'm, I'm, I'm just guessing. Because I teach social media here, uh, but uh, I'm not on the staff per se. But you know, I, I, I do teach here. But the question I'm asking, so what are you going to? There, I know there's some young people that think about law, but how would they? Pursue it. I mean, what do they? What do they do? I'll let Saran answer that question. Okay. <laughs> well, first of all, they would. Um, while you're in high school, the first thing that you can do right now is make sure that you're keeping up you know, on your classes. What you need for a law, that's your uh, avenue that you wish to pursue. You need to be uh, uh, cognizant. Uh, you need to be uh, well off in your English classes. The writing is a huge part. Of it. Uh, a lot of research, there's a lot of writing, and a lot of reading. So you make, want to make sure that you are keeping up with um, those. As well as if get involved in some extracurricular activities with, uh, as far as public speaking, debate. Toastmasters. Toastmasters, absolutely. <laughs> okay. Toastmasters. Yeah, yeah. So those are some things that they can uh, get involved with. Okay, but, but okay, I'm asking you guys, so what what if I screwed what if I screwed up and around for my th first three years, and, you know, so I I'm asking, I'm asking. In, 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 in high school, in high school, in high school. I'll be very honest. I was a mediocre high school student. I was a C student, a C or C or C minus student. I knew better, but I didn't apply myself. However, what happened? Don't let anybody tell you that you can't do something. I had, unfortunately, I had a parent in a position to tell me that I was never going to amount to, to anything. Wow. Here I am today. I have my master's. I have my master's. Yeah. She's a teacher. She also taught. And I got a full ride to the So don't let nobody tell you what you can't do. You know, use that. Use that negativity to fuel your motivation. Show him. Show them. You have the last. You're in control. Absolutely.